3 million years ago, a group of gigant Spinosaurus were leisurely foraging by the seaside. Their massive bodies required enormous amounts of food to maintain energy. So they spent their entire lives eating while they walked, but they didn't notice at all. Three Sinotyrannus were staring at them from the cliff behind. Faced with so much food, the Sinotyrannus were dazzled with excitement. After discussing their attack strategy, they led the group slowly toward the gigant Spinosaurus from behind, preparing to launch an attack on their prey. Sensing the unknown danger, the gigant Spinosaurus had no choice but to speed up and flee. After all, survival is a natural instinct for all creatures, and the Sinotyrannus would not let such a great opportunity slip away. They kept close behind the fleeing prey. But Gigant Spinosaurus was not an easy target. Their thick and sturdy skin, along with the long spikes on their tails, made them dangerous. Seeing that there was nowhere left to run, the Gigant Spinosaurus turned around to fight. Facing the ferocious attacks, they swung their spiked tails again and again, striking the Sinotyrannus in the face and deflecting the attacks repeatedly. For a moment the Sinotyrannus could do nothing, but that didn't make them give up. They changed tactics and surrounded the Gigant Spinosaurus, looking for a weakness. Realizing the danger, the Gigant Spinosaurus shifted their defensive formation. They stood back to back, forming a tight defensive circle, protecting their heads first to avoid the Sinotyrannus bites. Their exposed backs needed no worry because they were covered in spikes. They kept swinging their spiked tails while slowly rotating. Eventually, the impatient Sinotyrannus had to leave angrily. It was pointless to continue the standoff. But unexpectedly, they met again in a nearby canyon. This time, the Gigant Spinosaurus showed no fear and confidently drove the Sinotyrannus away. Having witnessed the defensive strength of the Gigant Spinosaurus, they hesitated not and immediately turned to leave, heading deeper into the distant forest to find other prey. In that forest, a family of Pachycephalosaurus was resting. The Sinotyrannus were about to attack, but an adult Pachycephalosaurus spotted them. It quickly woke its young then rushed forward, blocking the Sinotyrannus with its body. This prevented the Sinotyrannus from striking immediately. The Pachycephalosaurus bit one Sinotyrannus by the mouth first. Another Sinotyrannus rushed in and bit the Pachycephalosaurus neck. The third one tried to attack the young, but the size difference stopped it from landing any real attack, and it was thrown away easily by the Pachycephalosaurus. The Sinotyrannus lay on the ground for a long while before slowly standing up. It stared helplessly at the leaving Pachycephalosaurus family and could only continue searching for its next meal with an empty stomach. 